Well, hello everybody, and welcome back here for the penultimate time to Plants vs Zombies. It's time for a pogo party. Oh, this does not look good. Okay, so we're going to need plenty of sunlight, so we'll start off with the sunflower and the twin sunflower. That should give us a... Uh, uh, well, it should give us a good grounding in sunlight. Then we'll take... Because this is the roof, we'll take the cabbage pot and the kernel pot, I think. And for defense, we'll squash and the tall nuts. We we'll use squash to, uh, to, well, to squash until we can build a tall nut. That should uh, fill the gap there. And what else? Uh, we're going to need the flower pot, but I think I'll pick that up last. Um, what else would be useful here? Okay, the melon pulp, definitely. Um, is there anything else that would be useful? I don't really think so, to be totally honest with you. Yeah, a lot of this stuff is only available during the day. We don't need the water stuff. The pea shooters are a bit useless. Let's get, let's get the jalapeno. And we'll finish off with the plant pot. Let's see how we do, shall we? Ooh, should I have gone to the shop first? I should have gone to the shop first. Never mind. Right, let's get some sunlight generation going. There we go. Get another plant out. Okay, so now I'd like to build up to about 100. And we'll start using over 100 for plant generation. There we go, that's 100. That allows us to put down our first cabbage pole as soon as we see we need it. Or I might just put a squash down to start off with, to be honest with you. There we go, that's that. Now let's get some more sunlight out. Fortunately, it gives you plenty of time to build up here. And we're probably going to need every moment of it, because I forgot to get some rakes. But never mind. Okay, stick another one of you down. Okay, you're first, and I think we've actually got the resources to start off with one of those. There we go, and we'll stick a cabbage pot behind that. And that will get rid of him while we're dealing with that problem. Okay, that's a good start. We're back to having enough for another cabbage pot. And there we can put our last sunflower in, that is brilliant. Uh, I think I'm just going to put a squash in there for now. There we go. That's good. Hey, good work, squash. Oh, good. They're coming down there again. Okay, so I think we can afford to invest one of those. That should slow him down. Well, when it chooses... There we go. There goes a bit of butter. Brilliant. Better butter. Hey. That's a freeze from where I come from, isn't it? A fair bit of butter. Uh, right, so there we go. Okay, that, that tool nut is starting to suffer a bit of wear, but it will do us for now. Okay, and we've got squash back, which is brilliant. So let's just build up a bit more sunlight. There we go, here's the next one. We'll pop the squash down there. That's enough for another full set of defences, which is excellent. There we go, thank you very much. And we shall put them here. Have that as well. Defences, there we go. Okay, so uh, over halfway towards the basic set of defences with nothing else, which is perfectly fine by me. Need a little while for the tool nut to recharge. Well, I think we'll be all right. Uh, okay, so we've got three large waves coming and we're getting near the first one, so it would be good to get some more basic defenses down, I think. 
So let's do that there, and we'll pop a cabbage pot there. And if nothing else, that allows us to put a squash down for this, this last line. But let's see if we can actually build a proper defense there in time. I don't think we can. I also think we're probably going to need to replace some of these tool nuts soon. Here he comes. All right, we'll deal with you like that. And now... Excellent. Okay, so last tool up just in time. And we'll pop cabbage pot there. I think we'll reward ourselves with a bit more sunlight for getting this far. And now, there we go. Um, pop you there, I think. The. Uh, Kernel pulps at least are... Kernel pulps? Yeah, kernel pulps. They are quite cheap. So, I don't mind spending the money, to, well, the sunlight to uh, put these out. And we're nearly done with those. Excellent. We should have the sunlight to get some more sunflowers out as soon as that recharges. So, pop you there. The kernel pulps have the advantage of extending the life of these tall nuts, so they are really useful for us. Get more sunlight. Like that. Okay. Okay, our last one of those. Marvellous. Now we need to get this final line of defences in place, and I think what we're going to put in there is the melon pulps because they do a lovely bit of damage. The only problem is they're very expensive. So we're going to need more and more of these twin sunflowers. I think we're probably close to needing to replace that guy now. Okay. Go. Right. Okay, so let's get our first put you there. Get our first melon pot out. There we go, and one of them. 125, there we go. I think, yeah, let's replace that tall nut now. Well, we have a chance because that one is desperately in need of changing now. Uh, it's going to take a little while for the tall nut to recharge. Uh, so let's work up to our next melon pot, shall we? is not going to take us that long because we've just done it so we'll stick to you there I think that's great we're coming up to the next big wave so the next thing we want to do I think is replace that corner which we're just about going to be ready to do there we go marvellous that's our defences rebuilt so let's reward ourselves with another double sunflower I think yeah there we go Yeah, those melons are really going to help speed this up now. So let's work on a third one. Cool, cool. Thank you very much. Don't mind if I do. Okay, so nearly there. 325 we need. We've got 250. And yeah, we got through that big wave quite easily, I think. There we go. And there's our next... Let's pop you up here, I think. coins when we can. You never know when you need them. Okay. And... Well, if it recharge... There we go. It recharged. There's our last twin sunflower. And that is us sorted out for generation. And we just need now to get a couple more melon pots down and I think we are finished. Okay, so we'll pop you there. Grab some coins. And we got one more left to generate. And we got a few plenty of time in order to do it, so I think we're doing alright. How are our tool nuts doing? Yeah, they're not suffering that much at all anymore. Which is good. Pop 
few there for now. There we go. And there is our last one. If we had more of these slots, which we can't afford just yet, I would have had the uh, the the freeze melon as well. The frozen melon, I think it's called. There we go. Final wave. Drops a few extra walkers in, not a problem. And I think we are done. So let's just watch the final zombies being melloned to within an inch of their own lives. There we go. Keep collecting those trophies. Well, that leaves us with Dr. Zomboss's Revenge. And then, ladies and gentlemen, we are done. But that's going to be next time. So until then, I have been Simon Parsons. This has been Plants vs. Zombies. Thank you. And good night. <laughs>